more breaking news be, because of uh, what's going on in Afghanistan. Something that flew under the radar on Friday was that the national tax, uh, I forget what they're called, national tax something or another. Anyway, they put out the statistics for the number of Americans that are paying taxes. and Like paying it, into taxes. It, yeah. It, it turns out that 61% of uh, the country is not paying any taxes at all. Like six, by choice or? It didn't say by choice. It just says only six. It says that 61% of, of the country is not paying any taxes. Federal income tax. Is yes. that what you're referring to? Okay. Yes. Well, it could be because they're not working. <laughs> it's disturbing that they're not, they didn't, they didn't pay any tax in 2020. Yeah. What's disturbing about this is that when you have more people, uh, not paying taxes than are paying taxes. And then you continue to. They'll just print money. We'll be okay. whine about the rich <laughs> not paying their fair share. Mm -hmm. Who is paying their fair share of 61% aren't paying at all. That's exactly right. That's exactly right. And here's, here's really the, the biggest problem is if you're not invested, you don't care. Right. Yeah. Um, that, that's why entrepreneurs do so well is because they're invested in their company. Yeah. Um, if you have team members, uh, employees, whatever, and they're, they have a bonus base. This is why I always thought that everyone should be paid commission. Yeah. Now, you got to eat what you kill. It's very difficult to come up with a commission, uh, plan for, let's That's say true. a receptionist or someone that answers the phone or, or, or whatever. Um, but they all should, everyone in the organization should be invested somehow with some sort of profit sharing in order for them to have the incentive to do their best. Now, are we set up that way now? Uh, not all of us. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, I, not I, not know, I agree. And yeah, I think I'm just that, saying you know, it's, when it's you're hard, saying that, it's hard to structure. Say. I'm not being careful. <laughs> It's hard to structure it. It is. <clears throat> but if it's based off of profit year over year, yeah. Um, customer service, so you send out surveys what, and things like that. My, my point here is what's the incentive for the people to vote for holding down taxes when you're not paying it? Right. When the majority aren't paying it. Yeah. But the majority is voting it to raise it for other people. Yeah. How is that fair? Yeah. It's yeah. That's, weird. that is interesting. Isn't it? It's a good point, but it makes you wonder why they're not paying taxes. You know, what's what, how are they falling through the cracks? How are they hopping into the loopholes? You know, what, what's well, been put think, out there? Uh, what percentage of the population is living at or below, poverty. below the poverty line, mm -hmm. you know, stuff like that. Okay. Yeah. So a lot of the um, incentive money was, tax-free. Mm -hmm. So they're probably including a lot of that. Yeah. But then there's a lot of people that maybe they didn't file taxes because all the unemployment that they were getting, they didn't think they owed it. But yeah. That's what? a good point. That's going to sneak up. <laughs> they, they do owe it pretty quickly. Drug, so the drug dealers don't pay taxes. I don't know. Do the pharmaceutical companies pay taxes? <laughs> actually, actually, they probably don't. <laughs> <laughs> who, who, who put that up? Well, apparently, that a, us. Oh. <laughs> so, by the way, that's how they get you. You're required to pay tax on the profit for your ill-gotten gains. And if they can't catch you for your ill-gotten gains, they can catch you for not paying taxes on them. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> I'll get you one way or the other.